accidents and repairs. It's something a lot of us don't think about until we're in a bind and need help immediately. Or our next guest says it's your car and your choice. Don't be afraid to ask the right questions when choosing a shop. And here to tell us more is Bob McSherry, who is the owner of the North Haven Auto Body Shop. Welcome to the show. Good afternoon, Desiree. Thanks Great for having me. Great to have you. So let's talk about the fact that you say it's important to make sure you're picking the right facility. It is important. You get in an accident, an average driver once every seven years, so you want to do your homework. You want to make sure that the person that's repairing your car is repairing it properly because everything rides on it, you, your family, safety, and also gets you to work, and that's how we all make a living. And, Bob, what's interesting is that not every you know, auto body shop will tell you, listen, communication is key, but you're saying you really want to make sure you're communicating. Correct. You need to set the expectations with the repairer as far as how you'd like to be contacted during repairs. A lot of people say, call me when it's done and I'll pick it up. Some people like to be called every day, every other day. There's multiple ways to be contacted. You need to let them know how to get hold of you, whether you want to be texted, phone call, email, or whatever method works for you. What's interesting is a couple of questions were brought in, and one, went, one was, what is insurance steering? So kind of explain that for us. When you, when you have an accident, you call in the claim. If you have a shop in mind, they are not supposed to push you to another repair that they work with. Um, a lot of repairs have direct repair programs set up to where they utilize different shops throughout the state and you can take the car there it streamlines the process. There are some good programs out there and there are a lot of benefits to these programs but they're not for everybody and not everyone's the same. So Bob, tell us a little, about, a little bit about qualifications. What are some of the qualifications that we as drivers should know or actually request when we go into an auto body shop? You want to know how they maintain their training. There's multiple things. There's ICAR training, which is the industry standard for auto body. There's um, ASC training, which is a lot more um, book and knowledge training. There's a lot of training available from the, um, the car manufacturers. You want to make sure that the people working on your car know what they're dealing with. Exactly. So let's talk about North Haven Auto Body. How long have you all been around? Uh, since 1938. 1938, a long time. Yep. So when you, when you go into your place, you say it's important to make sure that when you walk into an auto body shop, it's a place that you actually feel comfortable leaving your car. Mm -hmm. Ask yourself questions like, you know, are the restrooms clean? Are the, is the floor clean? Why yeah. is that so important? You get one chance to make a first impression. Uh, cars are second biggest investment most of, most of us will make. Um, you want the car in the right hands. A clean office, a clean grounds and all that gives you a little bit of an idea what the people in the building are all about. And you're kind of progressive over at North Haven Auto Body. You talk a little bit about being environmentally friendly. Yes. Tell us about that. Um, we're the first body shop in New England to be partially solar driven. We've got 5,000 square feet of solar panels up on the roof. We uh, utilize waterborne paint finishes which uh, reduces our um, emissions and painting about 50 percent as far as the base coat process so we do whatever we can and proper recycling and all that to you know contribute and be a good part of the community we're in i like that which is kind of a great segue for you because you all are really big advocates in your community you're part of the little league team what other stuff are you all doing in your community we do a lot of different things as far as um community involvement in Tuesday and August 24th we're um, hosting a vehicle extrication class and hybrid vehicles at the shop I got an instructor coming in from California that'll show all the firemen we're going to invite all the firemen from the county as far as how to properly deal with these cars and cut them and be safe while they're doing it so you know someone's going to watch today and I know me as as a woman I like to feel empowered and feel like I, it's okay to walk in with a list of questions and you're saying if you have questions don't be afraid to walk in with a list Oh, absolutely right. I mean, it, it's important that your car gets repaired right, and it's more important that you feel comfortable with the place that's doing it. Don't be afraid to ask the questions. I it's like your that. car, and it's your choice. I like that. Your car, your choice. You're over yep. here empowering me over here. Exactly. I like that. <laughs> exactly. That's our job. <laughs> All right. Listen, if you want to get in touch with our friends at North Haven Auto Body, here is the information, everybody. It's on the screen. It's www.northhavenab.com. Of course, their number is 239-5651. Bob, thank you so much for dropping by. Thanks for having me. We appreciate it. Now, you stick around long enough, you might learn a little something.